looks a little bit different in the setup today because I have gone to Big Lots and bought, I don't know if you can see it all the way, this. Oops. I messed it up, y'all. There we go. So, this three drawer container organizer thing. And what I'm going to do with it is put my nail stuff in it. And if I have room, I want to put some hair stuff in there as well, which I'm pretty sure I'll have room. Because I think I can put all my nail stuff in one drawer. Um, but since I'm doing this organization of my nail drawer, I'm going to show, show you guys all of my products that I have. Some of you guys seen, some of them you have not seen. And so we're just going to go over um uh, some of the stuff that i do have uh if you just saw me throwing stuff my daughter has her hair bows in my nail stuff so ah this thing my practice hand i got this um from amazon i've used it kind of i played around with it but i'm gonna do my nails tomorrow and i may practice with this later on today to see what i want to do with my nails and I'll record one, uh, either me doing the practice hand, me doing my hands, or I may do both. Since I'm still off for a couple more days, I have been on vacation um, and have gotten lazy because I should have pumped out more content, but can't change the past. I've just been having fun. Um, but yeah, so this practice hand, you can stick the nail tips in or you can glue them on and then they'll soak off or whatever. Um... I can't remember how much I paid, but like I said, I'll put links for everything down below. It wasn't too, too expensive. It's kind of hard to bend, but I guess, you know, that's good if you're practicing, you want to keep it stable or whatever. So I'm actually just going to put that on top. It's just going to be on top on display. So when I do sales, I can kind of display here on the top. So that's all for that. Um, the next thing I got the Burano kit um and my daughter messed up the packaging i did i got the burano kit i know you guys have seen it everywhere all over instagram all over facebook but it comes with this beautiful instruction kit i mean instruction manual um basically telling you step by step how to do your nails if you want to use nail forms if you want to use the dual forms um, how to do the glitter warning tips if they're falling off how to remove them if they're too sticky what to do there is a YouTube channel they said just search Burano poly gel on YouTube and they will show you more um, tips on how to use this kit so I thought that was kind of neat it came with dual forms in the box and I have already used some of them for my epic fail nails that I am in the process of taking off um I may put up a picture I may not I don't know it was an epic fail just fail um but you live and you learn I so saw I still rock them but I took them off very fast it comes with the picker tool brush combo and this works really really well you guys like really well and it comes with slip solution and it, it's a clear slip solution it's not like some that you have they'll make the clear poly gel like yellow um this doesn't do that it keeps everything clear and it came with one two three four five six seven poly gels uh, light apricot, white, pink, magic orange, magic purple, soft pink, and nude. For my last set of nails, I used my epic fail nails. I used the magic purple and it did really, really good. I liked it. Um, then I used the blue glitter and the silver glitter I know you really can't see it but I am gonna do a another video because I'm actually gonna use the 
Toronto kit, I believe. Next. It also came with a clear nail forms, which I thought was really, really cool. And the top coat and the base coat that you need. And as you can tell, I already used the file, but it came with a file. And it says, congratulations, you qualify for one year free product replacement insurance. And if anything is wrong with your product, contact and they'll send you a new replacement. No need to return the item with defect. And it says, register your product now, which I did. Um, so that's everything that came in the kit. I can't remember the price, but it was $39.99 is sticking out of my head. Uh, that may be it, but I'll double check. I, but I'll, like I said, I'll link everything down below. But it comes with everything you need to do your nails if you want to use nail forms, if you want to use dual forms. I'm going to practice, not this time with my practice hand, but the next time with my practice hand, I'm going to try to do, use these clear nail forms because I want to learn how to sculpt nails and I've been watching a lot of videos uh, from Femi Beauty, Long Hair Pretty Nails, and learning how to sculpt because both of those you know, uh, ladies do a really good job of sculpting and making the nails just look beautiful with nail form, so I'm gonna learn how to do that. Just trying to put this all back in here, so. Then I have some BT Art Box fake nails. These are like to make press-ons, or um, if you can practice, put these on and then use the acrylic over top or poly gel over top, because they already kind of are curved and shaped and everything. I also got from Amazon like a couple of little jewels on my own. This one is like pearls and charms and flat backs and I guess I can get closer so you guys can see. But like flat backs and pearls and different things. It's still in the package. I haven't used it at all. This one is little charms, different things. This one's like fruit slices, flat backs, a couple pearls, um, and some 3D flowers and snowflakes. I got these in a four pack for like $7.99, I remember. Um, this one is like to do like winter nails. It has white pearls, white snowflakes that I use on my epic fail nails, uh, iridescent uh, snowflakes, different little charms and stones and things like that. Then I ordered some jelly gel nail polish. Um, They're like blue, purple, yellow, and they come in these pretty little things. So I've got these circles to swatch them. So we could, these are the colors. I think one of the yellows is supposed to be like a goldish. No, one's yellow and one's like orange. That's what it is. And then there's a red on the end. There's. This is that blue I was talking about. Oh, wait, I still have one of them on. Like, I don't know, a lot of people liked it. My personal thing was I didn't like the blue. I wanted it to be a darker jelly blue, I guess. But, yeah. So here are the swatches from that. And I'll link this down below because, like I said, I can't remember how much I paid for this. I got this a while back. Then I got a Secret Santa gift uh, for participating in one of those. It was um, Influencer, I think. And the lady sent a really cute note. Um, 
and she sent me this kit. I don't know how to pronounce it. Cosella? Cosella? I don't know. Professional nail art. Um, it came with all these really pretty glitters. Oh, you can really see that. They're really, really pretty. Uh, it came with some tools, some nail files, a 600, a buffer, uh, 180, and another 180, some tweezers, some nail art brushes, and a cuticle uh, clipper thing, cutter, however, whatever those things are. I don't use them, so I have no idea what they are, but they come free in a lot of kits. Um, came with these little storage containers. I think for your powder and your monomer. It came with three powders. Uh, clear, pink, and white. Um, I don't really deal with acrylic. I said one day I was going to try again when I get my own space and that smell is not in the house. With baby girl. And it's like a liquid container with a little pump dispenser. I thought that was cute. <laughs> yeah, I already put a nail on this, but um, I was playing around. But this thing is creepy. Like, I don't know, it creeps me out. But it's a little practice finger, and you just stick the nail or the nail tip in there, and I. Stuck a tip in there just to see, you know, if it would fit or whatever, and it kind of fits. Um, so I, I may do some practicing with this too. You know, it looks creepy. Um, cuticle pushers, the wooden ones that come with everything. It came with uh, some little crystals, some little whoops, confetti like. Little jewels are like hearts and stars and different shapes and colors. Uh, nail forms. Clear tips. White tips. Nail clipper. I love these things. I have another one somewhere that I bought. Okay, with a nail file. Toe separators, a little duster brush, and some more little jewels. So I thought that was really, really cute. And I, I thanked her for that. I appreciated her for that because I saw that kit like some months ago. I put it on my wish list and she got it for me. And then I know y'all seen this kit before. Some Model Ones Poly Gel kit. I don't even know if all the stuff's in here because I've used this kit over and over again to do multiple nails. And it's still poly gel in each and every single one of them. Uh, soft pink, color changing, uh, purple pink or whatever color it was, light apricot, and pure white. This is the only one that I have not actually used. Um, but it came also with your brush to do your uh, nails with. Cute little pink brush, but I've used it. I've got stuff all over it because I used it a lot. Use this kit. I did uh like four sets of nails with this kit, and I can still do some more. It came with dual forms, they're all scattered all over the place, but it came with top coat and base, and it was a good starter kit for it was like 25 bucks, 23 bucks. I'll link it down below. That's Oh, this is my nail clipper that I like, my favorite one. So I got this for like seven bucks on Amazon. And I got some quick dry nail primer um, from Sally's a long, long time ago. Once I figured out that you needed to put primer on your nails. And also I have the just standard cute little pink drill that everybody starts out with. Um, I will upgrade that. I bought some iridescent snowflakes. 
on Amazon. Use them for the epic fail nails. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna show y'all a picture. I've talked about them on the they were this right here. I've used this a lot too. This is my McCart clear poly gel. This stuff is so clear, like it's clear like acrylic. Like it's my best friend. Like I need to buy some more because I've been using it. I use it with almost every set I do for one fingernail at least. And then I have, uh, I'm not fancy yet with my stones and stuff. So I got a wax pen or whatever to pick up my stones. It came with some kit I bought. But yeah, so this is what I have started with. I also bought this. It's nail glue, professional nail art. It's builder gel in a little container. Basically, this is the one that's open. So this must be the one that's open. Hope it doesn't splatter everywhere because I use it everywhere. So yeah, it's like builder gel in the bottom. It came two in a pack. So I'll link all the stuff I bought down below so you guys can see it and see the prices. Because prices may have changed, but this stuff has been useful in helping me to do my nails. I also have a cuticle pusher I bought because I like the pretty colors and it's got the sharp end to push back your cuticles and get all that gunky stuff up.